Hello and welcome to another Popper video. Today we're taking a swing and playing some Boros Boros uh, synthesizer here. This is a deck that has been given to me by Ritual Hippie, who is a Patreon supporter. Thank you so much. And uh, this is his uh, donation deck for the month of April, coming out a little bit late, but look for another Ritual Hippie donation deck this month, month of May. Uh, if you're not familiar with this deck, we're using Core Skyfisher and Glenhawk to pick up things like Experimental Synthesizer, Spare Supplies, Thraben Spectre, and Bitter Reunion to turn these into uh, flying card draw creatures. Now the thing that's the most important is picking up Experimental Synthesizer because it's a red for essentially draw a card, exile a top card of your library until end of turn you can play that card, and then you can sacrifice it to like draw another card and create a 2-2 white samurai creature token. So we're playing really cheap creatures that fly, plus we've got four galvanic blast, deals four damage to target any target with metal graft, and the, the deck is trying to turn on metal graft, and four lightning bolt. Uh, you can see in the mana base we've got four ancient den, two great furnace uh, to turn on metal craft, some three kabira crossroads for uh, life gain, Got one Forgotten Cave to cycle, one Secluded sec uh, Step to cycle, four of the Boros Bridges, two Mountains and a Plains, and one Lorehold Campus. If you haven't seen this, okay, this enters the battlefield tapped, and you can pay four to scry one. So that's like a late game uh, value land, which is sweet. Thraven Inspector makes a clue, blocks all day, and uh, it's a, a nice little dinky guy here and we got the glint hawks the core skyfishers these both have to pick up an artifact or and core skyfisher can pick up anything or oriox sun chaser is a metal craft 3 3 flyer which is powerful journey to nowhere is our exile effect spare supplies is an egg that draws a card and if you run out of gas you can sacrifice it to draw more cards and then this here is the spicy one of uh remember the fallen it's choose one or both, return target creature to your grave, from your graveyard to your hand, and return target artifact from your graveyard to your hand. So I asked him, why not recommission? And then he uh, clearly pointed out that you can do a two for one here by returning both a creature and an artifact to your hand. So that's kind of sweet. A little two for one. And then in the sideboard, we're playing three destroy evil for terror decks and uh, big creature decks. Two dust to dust. Uh, hopefully that'll help us with affinity. Two Patrician Scorn for Bogles, three Red Blast for Blue Decks, one Voltage Surge. It's basically another copy of Galvanic Blast just for creatures. You can sacrifice an artifact and it deals four damage, or it's just a shock. Two Smash to Dust uh, deals with the walls, affinity, clearing the way, and then two more Navigator's Compass for Burn Decks. So we can pick that up and gain a lot of life. Uh, thing I didn't notice or say was there's two Relic of Regenerus in the main decks. I think it's possible that we can go lower on Affinity Hate if you just never let them recur their creatures, so that does make sense. We kill everything, we Relic their creatures away, and they can't deal with it. Plus we have a clock, so hopefully that'll work out. Uh, Boros was one of the first decks I ever played. One of the first decks I ever played in Popper with just like the value mid-range engine, so I'm excited to play it again and see how good Synthesizer is. Uh, if you want to support me and and get your donation deck on the channel, just check out patreon.com slash uh, Let's do a like and subscribe and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Uh, some people are also playing the Gates package, but you have to give up on Galvanic Blast, so that's interesting. And uh, we'll see you in the matches. All right, we're here in match one. We have basically a terrible hand, I think. We just have too many lands. We're going to mulligan. Okay, we've got land, land. Okay, I think I'm going to keep this one. <clears throat> I think I'm going to put back the Sun Chaser as the weakest of our creatures. And uh, lead on Crossroads into Spare Supplies. All right, it looks like we're going to go Crossroads into Core Skyfish or the Crossroads. So they get in for one. We're looking for removal now. Crossroads go. Gain two life. I don't really want to pick up the crossroads. We'll see what happens. Okay, this is a Kadotha build. 
So I go and implement a combustion into cold health or rebirth. All right. Hits me for three. Bam. What should I do? Glint Hawk. Let's cast the spare supplies, draw a card. <clears throat> so the thing we can do is we can Boros Garrison the Kavira Crossroads to get the value out of it. Hopefully no uh, Bushwhacker this turn. They're dumping their hand. Another Kaldotha Rebirth. Holy God. <laughs> so this is when we would bring in the Smash to Dust, that's for sure. Yikes, we're at 10. Uh, Skyfisher. Pick this up. Garrison. Pick this up. The Reckless Impulse. Find an Epicure. Yikes. We're already dead, I think. This is 9. They have 6, 7, 8, 9 attackers. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yikes. Too free. Wow. Okie dokie. Being on the draw there was pretty brutal. Okay, so we got to get rid of our value things. Bring the smash to dusts. Any other life gain in the sideboard. The reunion is going to be pretty slow. Uh, we want all of our removal spells. Anything that can attack or block. I think the journey to nowheres are not going to be that great. So that should be fine. Okay. Hmm. We have more removal that we can bring in. So destroy evil or journey to nowhere. I guess journey to nowhere. All right. Wow. We got creamed. Okay. We would like to play first. So <laughs> we've got the the ancient dead thraben inspector. I guess we keep that. We, we, we need to block all day, right? Land inspector. That's the turn. So I think the next turn is land cycle. Maybe not. Okay, we have Galblast, the Thraven Inspector, the Mountain. Now Galblast is online for four, attack for one. We're on the play this turn, opponent, or this game. We can't do anything. Ha ha! They're going to smash our land. Okay. Uh, I think I'm still going to cycle this. Of course, Skyfisher. Okay. Swing out. I'm surprised that they're going for the uh, Smash to Smithereens route when they completely just dis destroyed us last game. But it is something they can do. We're going to Skyfisher pick up the Raven Inspector. That's the turn. Maybe I should have uh, waited for the Experimental Synthesizers to be online. Wow, okay. Sure. Kind of surprised. We found the land anyway. Never didn't have it. Haha! -ha! That's the turn. Take three, opponent. Yeah, so I think a lot of burn players transition to a control deck post-board, where I think that the deck is just better if you are an aggro deck. We'll see. They find a land. Play the land. Plays an Epicure. And Kaldotha Rebirth. Okay, so you got tokens now. We're going to lean on Synthesizer. We get our value. Find a Thraven Inspector. Hello. Play Crossroads. Gain some life. And I'm going to attack in the air. Just continue to uh, press. We'll leave the blockers back for their tokens and their 1-1s one and whatnots. And then pass the turn. So I put it on the taps. What do they got? Reckless Impulse into Blast Runner Swift Spear. If they play an attack with the Swift Spear, I can double block it this turn to kill it. Play the Blast Runner off the of land. Play Swiss Spear. No attacks. Let's see. I can. Let's lead on Skyfisher the Synthesizer. What do we get? Galvanic. Okay. We will kill the Swifty and play out a Thraven Inspector. Let's still attack with our core Skyfisher. Send. Maybe killing the Swifty is not that good there. So they would. It's six. I If I hadn't killed the Swift Spear, I could have won the game, I guess, on the next attack. Hmm. And combat math. You know what I'm saying? Oh, geez. It's hard. So they reveal and end the festivities. <clears throat> They're going to swing out and kill all my guys. Okay, whatever. It's fine. Everything is dead. 
<clears throat> That's not terrible though. We can always crack the synthesizer. They play another blast runner. So we can attack for four. Synthesizer first. Find a bridge. So we can play the bridge. Play the spare supplies. My Thraben Inspector clue tokens are just getting uh, wasted here. By the bridge, send, and that should be lethal because that's puts them to six. Next turn, they're dead. But they would have been dead this turn if I had not killed the Swift Spear. I guess I should have just chumped it. It's a learning experience, I think. Okay, they're going to crack the clue and discard. Discarding a Great Furnace. All right. Play the Swift Spear. So right now, this is. 9 dam it's going to be like 9 damage. Play a synthesizer. Galvanic. One card in hand. They kill the course guy fisher. Okay. They get in. Puts me to 8. And then we're just going to go red. Blast. Bolt. I'm on. Click. You're dead. Let's turn. Kabam! Alright, that worked out okay. <clears throat> Still think the smash to this is good. I'm glad that they slowed down. Thank you. <laughs> Let's try again. These are fast games, wow. Okay, this one, I it's slow, but I'm going to keep it. We have Kabira Crossroads gain two life. Turn two, Thraben Inspector, Boros Garrison. They don't lead on anything. So, gain some life. Turn to Thraven Inspector and Bar Boros Garrison. Pick up the Vist, gain some life. We have a blocker for their uh, Kuldothas. They find a land, play another implement. So, they're probably on some more Kuldothas, and we're looking for a Smash to Dust now. Thraven Inspector, we got that blocker. Boros Garrison picking up the Kabira. So, one thing that was used in a uh, previous. Boros list was the uh, Radiant Fountain, but it seems like we need the um, the actual value here. Uh, okay, so they're going to get in. We're going to gain two life. I don't really want to waste a Gal Blast on a creature, but I guess I have to. Play the Thraven Inspector. Go ahead and take out one of your creatures. I think I'm going to use a Bolt. They play the Swiss Spear. See, that's what I want to say the Galvanic Blast for. The Lightning Bolt. All right. Although we have the journey to nowhere for their Swifty, what do we do? Lean on synthesizer. Bolt. Darn. You can play Sun Chaser or get rid of the Swift Spear right now. They have a bolt for the Sun Chaser. It's super bad. Let's just journey the Swift here. Yoink. You're dead. Pass the turn. We're going to be taking five and going to nine. So dead to. Um, Bushwhacker here. If we draw into the uh, Smash to Dust, our opponent's super behind. I think we are not in a very favorable position. Real Shaman. They're going for my artifacts. Okay, goodbye to the clues. Surprised that they are going to let me just have it. Ugh. Um, interesting. Okay, play the Sun Chaser. So we have a 3-3. Three, three. <sighs> hmm. I think we just die. We're at 1. And they have a bolt, I'm sure. We ran out of... We just didn't have any mana, so that's my fault, I guess. Play spare supplies. Okay, we're dead. On, on to round 2. Round 2 versus Solarme. In the past, they've liked to play, like, value decks. We need a second land, so we're going to mulligan this. This seems fine. Let's see. Like campus. We're just gonna turn one ancient end, turn two garrison. Keep that. Let's get rid of the bitter reunion. We're planning on getting value out of the synthesizer. Play the Raven Inspector. And pass. Going to gang? Oh no. Alright, Thraven Inspector, Boros Garrison, picking up this. No tax. Now we need to find our journey to nowheres. <clears throat> so I think the plan is to, I guess, run out the synthesizer looking for a journey. If we find a red land, it's fine. If we find a blast, it doesn't do that much. 
So Patrician Scorn can be good in this matchup. They have a Benevolent Bodyguard. Uh, no attack. I'm not going to block this time. I need to wait for a bigger damage chunk. Wow, we have it. <clears throat> Journey to Nowhere. Exile this. They can sacrifice to give it protection from white. We'll play the Lorehold Campus. Pass the turn. I guess we could have attacked into the, the token. That would be fine. So next turn, they can suit up the Laguna Gang, and then I can core Skyfisher the Journey and uh, Journey it again. Because giving it protection from white is not that great for them. <clears throat> All right, we're just going to keep trying to core Skyfisher. Pick up the Journey. Play the Journey. Get rid of your guy. They give it protection from white again. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> wow. Okay, they have a stave off. Now it's a 3-7. Ethereal armor. So now we are going to block. Because we're going to soak up the 9 damage this turn. And then get rid of the thing. Block and block. Pass the turn. Guy Fisher. Pick up this. Pick a, get rid of this thing. And our opponent is sad about it, which is fine. Yeah. And then they're going to lead on... They're going to play a Crow and Skyguard. So I think we're going to play the Synthesizer here. Bam. What do we get? Play this bridge. Cycle this. Spare supplies. Okay. Swing out. That's a turn. <clears throat> what do they got? Can they kill us this turn? Benevolent Bodyguard. It's a different artwork. And they get in for one. Put us to 14. Okay. So we can soak that back up with a Kabir Crossroads. Let's lead on the Synthesizer again. See what we draw. It's always nice to top deck a Synth. Secluded Step. Okay. Play the Thraben Inspector. Let's draw a card. Galvanic. Okay. Send. For now, we're dealing them 5 damage. So I think I'm going to save the Galvanic for lethal. Let's see what happens. Woohoo! We won a game. Let's see. Destroy evil, yep. Attrition scorn, maybe. And I want all the destroy evils actually. So is that better? What can we do? Remember the fallen? We don't need that value. Spare supplies could potentially be too slow. I think bitter reunion is gonna be the cut though. I don't think we need the Sun Chaser. We're not really an aggro deck. We just tried to removal them out. And that should be fine, right? Let's see. So kill all enchantments and kill... Hmm. Kill all enchantments doesn't work very well with my... Uh... <laughs> okay, we're going to we're gonna keep this because we have the Synthesizer uh, and the Clint Hawk and the whatnots. Uh, let's lead on Mountain. Pass the turn. We can turn to Synthesizer. Nothing. Let's play the Synth. Find another Synthesizer. Okay. Garrison picking up the land. Pass the turn. Next turn we can play Glenhawk, pick up the Synthesizer, and cast anything that we rip. Sun Chaser. Okay. So they're holding up removal spell. Okay. They have Hyena Umbra. So we can bolt that. Let's go Glenhawk, pick up the Synthesizer. Yes. So synth in hand. Find a three minute inspector. So we're gonna go bolt. Get rid of the umbra. Play the three minute inspector. Pass the turn. They play Cartusha Solidarity. Okay. Now it's quite big. Sentinel's eyes. Now it's vigilance. I think I'm gonna take it this turn. Ethereal armor. Their token. Sure. Homestead courage. Makes an 8-8. Eight, eight. Yeah, we're just going to take it this turn. No blocks. Looking for Destroy Evil. Journey to Nowhere. Let's play the Synthesizer. Okay, we find the Thraven Inspector. It's fine. What do we do here? We can just chump this turn. There are zero cards in hand, so we have to block both of these this turn. I think I need to maximize my card draws. Okay, pass the turn. So right now, this is going to be a 10. This is not an instance of sorcery. So if they just go to attacks, all right, we're going to quad block this thing, get it off the table. We go to four. 
Oh, first strike. Ah, uh, whoops. Okay, synthesizer. Well, that was pretty bad. Synthesizer again. Uh, I guess we have to destroy evil this guy. Yay! The Thriving Inspector. Last turn. <laughs> two two vigilance gonna wreck us. I think we have to jump again. Last time we jumped with too many creatures though. It's a four four. We're blocking. So we block and pass. And now play core skyfisher. Draw a card. We find a planes. Let's play the synthesizer. Land. Wow, I should have really have taken out the relics. Did not think that one through. Okay. Well that's not great. Uh play the relic. Whatever. Let's crack this. Draw a card. Cycle this. Okay, pass the turn. <laughs> Opponent is probably very salty now that I just like am terrible at doing anything. Although the relic was fine against their uh recursion spell. Sentinel's eyes. They have another Sentinel's eyes now. Block. Uh, okay, we have a lightning bolt. That's good. Skyfisher, pick up the synthesizer. Find another Glenhawk. Okay, Glenhawk, pick up the synthesizer. Yes. We would like to use that and not have to sacrifice my guy. Okay, core Skyfisher, pick up the synthesizer. Glenhawk. We can't cast that. Rough. Let's play a bridge. Pass the turn. We only need one attacker, and we can make attackers with the synthesizer. Pass. We're just going to jump. Block. Okay, they're continuing to admit Lamo in. All right, now we have the journey. Does this? Do you have protection from white? Get rid of your ethereal armor. Bolt. All right, perfect. Oops. So many mistakes were made. Oh my goodness. I really should have, uh, well, it didn't matter, right? Because I have to get rid of my own creature anyway, because I have protection. So it wasn't that big of a mistake. <laughs> it was a mistake, though. Ancient Den. Let's play Spare Supplies. Draw a card here. Swing. We've got one more Core Skyfisher in the deck that we can pick up the journey with. They don't have anything left in their deck. So let's play a Synthesizer. Another journey. Not helpful. Play a synthesizer, land. Okay, we can play the land. And we can spare supplies. I'm drawing some cards. We're certainly doing stuff now. Okay, we can course Sky Fisher. Yay! Get back the journey. Okay, pick that up. Let's pick up the synth. Find a patrician scorn that we can't cast. Alright, that's fine. Pass the turn. Send. Right now we have four damage from the Galvanic Blast and eight here, so they're dead in the next turn. They can't potentially do anything. Uh, just uh, draw a card. Another relic. Hmm. Land this relic you. Send. Aya. Four. All right. One down. We're one and one on round three. Okay, we're in round three versus Shatoon on land destruction, as they want to do. We have a turn one Galvanic Blast your elf, so I think that's fine. If they don't play the Arbor Elf turn one, we'll play the Thraben Inspector turn one. What are they going to do? Land destruction, a big meanie. Going to be very, very good versus our deck. Land, wild growth. Okay, pass the turn. So what do we want to lead on? I guess the Thraven Inspector has the turn. So they're licking their lips. They're like, yes, Boros, you will die. We just need a few lands. If we can rip a bridge off the top, that would be helpful. They play their second land. They have wild growth. Nothing. Well, okay. Um, Land. So the question is, do we want to... Play the Sun Chaser that probably won't get in. Or play the Spare Supplies and draw into another land. We just need to maximize drawing cards. Pass the turn. 
We could have mulliganed for a bridge, but I don't know if that would have been that helpful, really. Our opponent's pausing for uh, a few minutes on their upkeep. <laughs> Why? They play the Avenging Hunter. Oh boy. So if we find... We find a mountain here. We can kill it. Or else Garrison. That's definitely a problem. Let's play the Synthesizer first. Try to find a mountain. Find a bolt. Alright, let's borrow Garrison. Pick up the planes. Pass the turn. Right now we have Metalcraft. So we can try to bop the Avenging Hunter if we can. They just go straight for Avenging Hunter. Boarding party. Find a Utopia Sprawl. So we're going to take 13. Then the next turn we're going to take 7 and 5. So we're just dead. We have to block. We have to do nothing here. Wow. Can't believe it. All right. We're going to take the initiative. We're going to grab a land mountain, the last basic in the deck. Go ahead and kill this. Journey to nowhere. Get rid of that. And so now they need a haste creature. Play the mountain, I guess. Pass the turn. Yield. So what else can we do here? They have three cards in hand. They play a jewel thief. Another avenging hunter. All right, well, that stinks. So we go to two, which means that we need a way to deal with both these creatures. Synth first, I guess. So we can journey. Journey to nowhere. Get rid of the avenging hunter. Play the core skyfisher picking up. Or just play the Oriok Sun Chaser. Yeah, I play the Sun Chaser because it's a big, big blocker. So pass the turn. Can't believe we're at two. Yikes. And they somehow did not have any land destruction yet. A thermocarst? Sure. Doesn't do anything. We double block. They have the scred. Ugh. So this next turn they're gonna. So we're Glenhawk. Yes, pick up the synth, bolt this, play the Forgotten Cave, pass the turn. So they're going to Throne now. They find an Althasaur, which is pretty bad. They're just going to Boarding Party. Okay. And we will concede. <sighs> okay, the Relics, no. We want the Destroy Evils. And I think this is cut. That's really fine. That's pretty brutal. To be honest, we lasted longer than I thought we were going to. Okay, we're on the play. So if they have turn two land destruction, we're super dead. I think I have to mulligan this. What do we have? Computer crossroads. Okay, I guess this is fine. I'm going to put back the sun chaser. Having a flyer could be good, but I'm not sure I'm going to be able to get it on the, on the battlefield. We have crossroads into Thraven Inspector. Kill your Arbor Elf if possible. Maybe that first hand would have been good because... Alright, there there we go. Kill your Arbor Elf. It is a plan. Thraven Inspector. Kill that. They put a Utopia Sprawl on their land. We're going to play Spare Supplies. Play a land. Swing. They'll likely try to kill my land. They have four mana right now. Now they have four more mana. Blow up my land. Okay. So we have a campus. Just get the synthesizer into play. Rustfield Ridge is good. Let's pass the turn. Swing. If they play boarding party, we can blast we can uh, lightning bolt it. Right now they have six mana. They go for the Avenging Hunter. Okay. So the best draw for me would be a bolt. Really just like Ponza stuff. I'm going to attack. They block. Uh huh. Get rid of your creature. Play Thraven Inspector. Get my own creature onto the battlefield. Play Lore Hole Campus. Pass the turn. So they can lost well here looking for another creature. They went bottom bottom. That's nice to see. They have a Acid Moss on the Great Furnace, I guess. They kill the campus. Okay, that makes sense. And then play land. Three mana. Kill another land. Okay, they're out of action. 
We're gonna we get a land now, which is nice. We have a journey to nowhere. Attack. Let's grab a planes. Grab the planes. Play spare supplies. Find a skyfisher. Okay. Pass the turn. Pass the turn again. Now maybe we want to sit back on the, with the Thraven Inspector in case they draw a boarding party and we can block. But they are top decking, so who knows? They find a Gorilla Shaman, so they can kill most of our artifacts. Getting rid of our clue, getting rid of our other clue, killing our synthesizer. Okay, when it's serious about their land destruction, very very serious. Let's forge my creature. Play a bridge. Go ahead and core sky fisher. Picking up the spare supplies. And swing out. If they want to waste their turn spending five mana to blow up the spare supplies, be my guest. They play a land. They blow up the spare supplies. Alright, you have done that. I don't really want to journey to nowhere, the gorilla shaman though. We will put them to nine. Trap you. Synthesizer. So Let's draw a card with a synthesizer. Thraven Inspector. Yes, we're just going to journey there, Grill Shaman. They can blow up the synthesizer right now if they want to, which gives me another look for a land. Didn't find it. Alright, send. They're at four. What did you top deck? Anything good? We win. That is the way. Alright. Just resubmit. Okay, we're on the draw. We have zero lands. We have a bridge. Keep. Flip back. Um, hmm. Guess it's going to be one of the journeys. We go land Utopia Sprawl. We will play a land. Pass the turn. Lanoir Visionary. Okay, so we can kill the Visionary right now. Or we can Thraven Inspector and Glinhawk. Thraven Inspector, Glinhawk. Yes, pick up the clue. We blow up my Acid Moss. Alright. Let's play the Spare Supplies and Swing. Play Boarding Party. Revealing a Deglamour, getting rid of our land. That sucks. Play a Synthesizer, looking for a land. Find no land. So now we have to pass. Classic nonsense. Get rid of your creature. So they're probably going to just slam the initiative and I'm going to scoop here. Yep, okay. Let's play a different game. We're versus Lost on Kato, who's probably on Familiars, and we are likely going to lose. We have the turn one relic. <laughs> Pick up the mulligan. Uh, wow, terrible hand. We need lands. Where's my lands, bro? Mulligan again. We have lands this time. We have the synthesizer. Keep. So we're going to get rid of what? Land and land. Pass the turn. Crossroads go. What are they playing? They're like, what? You're on Boros? I don't understand. Time to jam. Multi five could be our crossroads. Not the strongest. Yeeks. Wow, okay, they're on Ice Tunnel. Let's land past the turn. Although I don't really want to get this spell pierced. Let's try the Synthesizer. Okay, pass the turn. Just afraid. I'm afraid. I think Linhawk. Let's see if they counter it. We have the Relic. <laughs> okay, I'm going to pick up the Synth. See if I can get a land again. I find a land! Huzzah! That's the turn. They consider. Okay, and consider again. So, I don't know if they are considering that I'm going to relic them. Pass the turn. <laughs> you need a counterspell. They have the counterspell. Synthesizer? A spell pierce? No. Land? Swing out. <laughs> they had the counter though. They cycle of fumes, so they're one, two, three, four in the graveyard, so terror costs three right now. Okay, pass the turn. 
we're going to pick up our synth with the coarse guy fisher. Yoink. Uh, Boris Garrison. So we can pick up the secluded step. Let's spare supplies here. Garrison the secluded step. Oh no, we don't have that. So let's just pick up the regular mountain. Swing out. That's the turn. I'm, I'm sitting on my 8 damage here, trying to get in uh, before they have a giant uh, life linker. 1, 2. We don't have enough for a metal craft yet. Now we do. Play the synthesizer. No, my synthesizer. Why you do this? Okay, Glint Hawk. Yes, pick up spare supplies. Land. Play the spare supplies. Okay, swing out. Now we need to get to Metalcraft. Pass the turn. There's six. Talarian Terror. Talarian Terror. Three mana. They're going to cast an Angler. So if I can get Metalcraft, they're dead. Maybe I should play Matherland. I was kind of nervous about the Spell Pierce. Okay, we have it. Synthesizer. Sun Chaser. Rustville Bridge. Attack. Control. Dome. Dome. Ba bam <laughs> Got him. Okay, Relic was fun. Uh, destroy evil we need, right? Uh, Red Blast. Still don't think I want Bitter Reunion or Remember the Fallen. Maybe Remember the Fallen is actually good versus them. Value spell. Uh, we do need the Journeys, right? These are all good. So I need to take out five cards. Maybe lightning bolts. I just feel like the sun chasers are probably the weakest card. I'm gonna bring back in the bolts. I guess it turns off a lot of our attacks, but hmm. Bring the, the bolts back in to close the game. But the red blast can counter their counter spells. We have six ways to kill their big guys. We have a turn one, turn two relic. <laughs> okay, I'm keeping. <sighs> Okay, land relic. <laughs> I got screenshot that. Okay, uh, okay, go. Uh, that's perfect. <laughs> okay, play a bridge. Pass the turn. Ooh, steel sabotage. Did not expect. I could have red blasted that if I didn't pass the turn. All right, so. Play a Thraven Inspector. Then I'm going to play my Boros. Let's cycle. Boros Garrison. Pick up my land. Next turn I can play Relic again. It's funny. Alright, so they consider. I have Destroy Evil for an Angler. I have a Red Blast for their Terror. They still sabotage my land. Brutal. Uh. Guess I'm gonna discard a Galvanic. Land. Play a Relic. Counter. Alright, Relic U. And save targets. Boink. Okay, send. That's pretty funny. So they're at three. They mental note. Yep. In Militaire. So if they play Terror here, I'm going to. Try to red blast it? I don't know. Two mana. One. They play a terror. Counter the terror. Donk. Uh, we'll go ahead and guess I'm gonna play the synth here. Land. Now I can pick the synth up. Pick up the synth here. We're gonna find a card. Okay. So I can just relic, pick up relic, or I can Pick up the clue token and crack the relic. I think I'm gonna pick up the clue token. Lindhawk. Pick up yes, pick up the clue token and go ahead and crack the relic. That's fine. Attack. Now we have synthesizer into Glenhawk. Okay. They thought scour themselves. What do they get? Crawl from the cellar. And a snuff out and a thought scour. They left the snuff outs in. Did not expect. Let's go with Synthesizer. This could get countered. They're going to Hydroblast the Synthesizer. 
play the Rustvale Bridge. Let's attack with everything. Pick up our land, our white land. Play the Rustvale Bridge, pass the turn. Now we have six in the air, potentially four coming in. They brainstorm. We have Destroy Evil for a big guy. Snuff outs are not very good versus us right now. They mill some thought scours. Let's see. Playing an angler. Alrighty. Angler comes into play. I think I'm going to. Hmm. Let's go play this. Attack. What I can do here is galvanic their angler now. And then if they have a response. You know, they're, they're at six. Because I want to be able to. Um, okay, look at that. Cast down. Destroy evil this. Pass the turn. They go to nine. We still have the galvanic online. They brainstorm. We can put them to five, uh, but then we don't win. They play consider. Okay, so they're milling part of the brainstorm, milling an island. They scooped it up. We win the game. Wow. Okay, on to round five. Fast league. Okay, I think I was greedy in the other. I think I'm just going to keep this one. Not really sure what we're up against. We're up against red. Land Swiss Spear Go. All right. So we want to play the Kabira and then I guess the spare supplies. All right, we'll lead on Kabira. Then we can get the Thraven Inspector into play, play the Rossfeld Bridge. Spare supplies. And then maybe the Sun Chaser can be a 3 3. Forgotten Cave. So this is a. Okay, this is a Koldotha build again. We get in. They're blasted. We have a Relic that doesn't do anything. Three Bin Spectre. The Rustville Bridge. Although I guess the Relic will help turn on Metalcraft. We already had Metalcraft on the next turn. We can go Relic into Spare Supplies and then just crack the Relic for, you know, a little value. We play Goblin Blast Runner. Okay. We're probably going to kill my Three Bin Spectre. I'm just having it. Oh, they do kill the Thraven Inspector. Okay. That's probably good for me. That has soaked up some damage. Okay, my turn. Uh, land. Thraven Inspector again. Make 3-3. Three, three. Pass the turn. They have a Seal of Fire, which will kill my Thraven Inspector. And give their Blast Runner uh, menace and everything. So... Don't really want to block, but they solved that problem for me by just killing my guy. Okay, we take six. Bam. Spare supplies, so let's draw a card. Looking for a removal spell. Found one removal spell. So we can play the campus, pass the turn. Question is, do I want to kill the Blast Runner or the Swift Spear? The Reckless Impulse. Bushwhacker Epicure. Scary. So they probably play the Epicure here. Okay. Let's see if they have any other things to do. Play a land. They're gonna crack the furnace, crack the implement, so we will kill this. Pass a turn. We're gonna take two and go to six. We need to have something to do. Play Skyfisher. Let's actually pick up the Kavira Crossroads. Replay it. Draw a card. Lightning Bolt. Alright, well, maybe I made some mistakes here. <laughs> Hard deck. Okay, so if I had not picked up the crossroads, I could have bolted their Swift Spear. But it's pretty much the same. Looks like they're going to Bushwhacker, putting us to two. I'm going to block the Swift Spear. So that's off the table. Then we can bolt this Kessig Flame Breather. Let's draw a card. All right. Kill this. Journey to nowhere on your bushwhacker. Basically, that uh, stalls the board a little bit. And then if I need to pick up the journey to nowhere for a different creature later, that bushwhacker is not very important. They go for chain lightning. <laughs> we worked so hard and nothing mattered. All right. Compass coming in. Maybe I didn't bring in the compass the other time. Smash the dust. Get rid of this. 
this. Are the spare supplies too slow or what? I think we just cut the journey to nowhere. All right, one more journey in. Oh wait, I read this is a removal spell that costs one. I want that instead. <laughs> oi, 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 oi. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, we're on the play. We have campus. I'm just going to keep and then uh, see if we can just naturally draw the second land or synthesizer into it. Although they could raise us, which would be a problem. Do not think that one through. Are they going to bring in raise against me? Maybe. Land. Swift spear. Attack. We take one. Okay, we found the land. So we can... Kill the Swiss Spear or Spare Supplies. I think I want to Spare Supplies. Just start doing things. Opponent plays a land. Implement. Probably going to call Delta here. They do. Okay, that's bad. Swiss Spear attacks us for 3. We go to 16. Lay land. Go ahead and bolt the Swiss Spear. Pass the turn. Pass the turn again. I think we want to course Guy Fisher, but oh man, here comes the bushwhacker. Bring it on me. I'm ready. Take 10 damage. <laughs> God. Ugh. What? <laughs> uh. Opponent misclicked on their attacks. They do not know you can right-click attack all. <laughs> Ridiculous. Okay, so we are just helping them because they're clearly new. And what are we going to do? It's like nothing nothing we can do, right? Well, we can synthesizer. Looking for our smash to dust. Because if we find it, we can glint hawk. Oh my goodness. I can't believe that happened. We can Glenhawk the uh, the Ancient Den, pick up the Ancient Den, replay it, and then go ahead and go smash the dust. Doink. That was unreal. I called it. We did exactly what we needed to do to stay alive, and then we're just going to die. <laughs> we are super duper blocking the Swiss Sphere. 100% of the time. Yep, block. So our opponent is passing. We will kill the Swiss Spear. Play a land. We just need more lands in play. I'm going to Skyfisher back the Spare Supplies. But now we're looking for uh, a Navigator's Compass. So I think I'm going to Skyfisher back the Synthesizer on the next turn. Right now we're at 2. Actually 7 from the Implement. So we're likely just dead if on their turn. They play a Synthesizer and they reveal Kessig Flame Breather. It's going to deal us a bunch of damage. Uh, any burn spell would be four minimum. So this puts us to three. We are not going to send it back because uh, we can't and it's bugged. Okay, play the Skyfisher. Okay, pick up the Synthesizer. Find a Gal Blast. So we can now kill this thing. We have one, two, three. Blast that. Okay, Synthesizer looking for a compass. Did not find it. Pass the turn. Swing. So we have to fade almost everything. Anything in their deck kills us right now. Hmm. Synthesizer reveals a bolt, and we're dead. I called bolt, and I knew it would be bolt. All right, that was an interesting league. I think uh, this this format is intense. Okay. Uh, overall, the deck was pretty fun. I think it's a, an enjoyable build. I think we need some more ways to handle the red deck. So things like maybe instead of Oriox Sun Chaser, you could play the Cold Delta Rebirth uh, yourself. So you could Cold Delta Rebirth your Synthesizer. And then maybe instead of Spare Supplies, we could play the um, Icar Wellspring. So we could just have like that synergy there. Spare Supplies was cool, but I think it's it never ended up being... Uh, useful because we never had time to draw a card off of it. Uh, maybe more Navigator's Compass in the sideboard or something. Destroy Evil seemed like it worked out pretty well against the um, 
the terror deck. So we also paired into Ponza, which is an auto loss for us. Lost a red twice, beat lost a Ponza, we beat uh heroic, and we beat a uh terror deck. So overall it was enjoyable. Hope you enjoyed. We'll see you in the next video. All right, and uh thank you very much, Ritual Hippie, for your support. Uh again, if anybody wants to uh pop in and get on the deck donation tier that gives you access to all the sideboard guides plus uh, a deck donation a month if you're interested in that. Uh, thanks a lot. We'll see you in the next one.